Greetings, everybody. I'm Aaron Kucharski. This is Laurel. And look at that sign. That sign back there says Big Top Flea Market. We're at the Big Top Flea Market, and you're watching Video Game Wizard on YouTube. Mm. Woo! Aaron's back, someone called the D.O. Here to claim his right as CEO. Laurel's here and she's watching the store. Back at the market helping me find a good score. Josh coming through with all the bling bling. Subscribe to him, call him the Lottery King. Grimsy is here from New York, it's true. Don't forget his number 42. Last but not least, Mama K has returned. Sharing all the knowledge that she has learned. Like and subscribe, see what Game Wizard all about. It's the flea market, y'all! So, for lack of a better pun, we're in F. And, uh, we have arrived at the Big Top Flea Market. At least it's Are you not excited, the, Laurel? Yes, at least it's not the BFE. Yeah, we're, we're, we're over here setting up at, at, the, at the Big Top Flea Market. I'll give you guys a rundown of the booth when we're all set up. Look at this sign. Big Top is now a smoke-free environment. Thank you for your cooperation. Woohoo! I know I keep saying this, but this literally is the first time I've been to the Big Top Flea Market. I'm looking for a friend of mine, Ed. He sets up out here. He always used to come to the wagon well and spend lots of money with me. So uh, this, is, this is the guy that you want to hit up. If you're ever at Big Top Flea Market looking for video games, the reason why I'm giving him a plug is because he's got he's got pretty all right deals uh, on stuff as well, and he's also in another county, so he doesn't really affect my business. So let's go see if we can find him. I don't know if this is him or not, but this definitely could be cheap video games, buy, sell, trade, retro, new age, and it's a really big booth. So that could very well be him. I just saw another game booth over there, uh, but it was a different guy, not the one that I'm looking for. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm checking up and down all these spider, spider side rows, and then I'm going to head back to see what the setup looks like. Just picked up some PS2 games um, at one of the Spiderwick Chronicles, I guess you can call it. Uh, and now i got to go from A over to B. These are these are some so the, the rows. I mean, they're 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 neatly laid out. Like there's spots everywhere, but uh, but it's 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 weird. It's not like wagon. Well, wagon well, I can go up one row, down one row, up one row, down one row. Here they're like all branched off. Like I said, it's like a spider web type deal, and it's like spider legs. And they're going all off in all different directions. But I mean, eventually I'm gonna make it back. So I'll keep you guys updated. Just bumped into uh, somebody from Webster Flea Market that that uh, sold sells video games over there. They're over here also, along with Ed apparently, uh, and they're booth D something. But the the booths are different. Like this D D four four hundred and fifteen. They're like in the hundreds for the numbers. But uh, I'll keep you guys posted, and I'll see you guys when I get back to the booth. Well, look who decided to wake up this morning. Um, Josh is here. Oh, Josh, you're not going to believe there's so many people here. It's it's nuts. So, uh... Hola. Yeah, Mama K now shows up along with Josh. A polar pop in hand. Um, and we're getting the booth set up. We got... Yeah, all Laura wanted was food. Uh, we got PS4, Xbox One. Ton of PS4 and Xbox One stuff, by the way. Bunch of new titles in exclusively at Game Wizard. PS3, 360. Uh, this is gonna look really good when we're done setting up these walls. When I'm done setting up. Well, when Laurel's done setting up, these, I, I'm gonna help her when I, in a second. So. Do you guys see a pattern here? There. First Sharon sets it up, then I set it up. This is why you never see me at the flea market. I don't want to set it up. Look at this. This is disgusting. Jeremy, I didn't know you were coming. It's one of the ones that come. It's yeah, that Hey guys. Woo! So, this is my first sale of the day. Dead Rising 2. 
Any words? My, yeah, my other idiot kid wanted this, not Jeremy, the, the younger one at home. And uh, I, hey, I, I just want to straighten all this up. I'm Papa Jerps, but I'm not the one that yeah, he's not, the shit out of you. Yeah, he's not the troll account yeah. Papa Jerps, he's the real Papa Jerps. Because I have better things to do on a Thursday night than watching a four and a half hour stream. <laughs> all right. So not only has she unleashed her pets on the market. Stop. Apparently she just spilled her drink eyeglasses. all the way in and through and into the next. Well, that's how the Polar Pop game goes, I guess. I gotta go get something mop. Tim. Hand pop, it's uh we just oh the balloon. Look at the balloon, guys. Um, anyway, we're heading back to the booth now. Uh, I got a soda. And I'm up to like seventy dollars. Oh wait, I, hold on a second. I gotta go find. Hold on. Hold on. I'll, I'll, I'll see you in a second. I completely forgot where I was going. She she's having problems with smells. Wait, did you say somebody just sprayed cologne, mother? Yeah. You can't breathe. She's allergic to water. I can't breathe, I can't breathe anyhow. <laughs> oh, that's one of those things. Do you want me to ask him to do a trade? Pro Oh god, and it's small too? Yeah, you wanna ask It'll fit in the corner. Oh, that would be perfect for the story. Oh! Mole's probably gonna kill me. Oh, and by the way, over here, they got Mama K's favorite game. It is the one, the only arcade there is. The Tetris. Woo! So it's the midway part of the day. Uh, things are going good. Here's the setup, Xbox One, PS4. 360, original Xbox, PS3, we got some systems, uh, we, got the, we got the Perlers, we, we, we love the Perlers, we got Disney Infinities, PS2, Wii, Wii U, and then retro stuff down here. And then over here we got Mama K and all her stuff, this is her setup, there's her their little Sega thing. Uh, yeah, I'm over 200 bucks for the day. Yeah, John Wiseman said he's uh, over 900 or over 700. Cool. Here's Aaron trying to unlock some for a Smash Brothers tournament. Woo! 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 But come on, I think I've worked out a deal, and it's a halfway decent one. I'm not. You're not getting totally screwed, and neither is the person. I mean, we'll see when I get over there. Fine. So after what I thought was me losing the tournament, I got back in on a secondary buy. Because um, anyway, I got to buy back in and I won the second time to go to the second round. And then for some odd reason, Josh won to go to the second round. Me and him got paired up against each other. Uh, Tom Brady, uh, Patriots versus the Bucks. And while Tom Brady won as usual, so I'm going to the finals. He's playing. Smash. It's the game he most likes. Which one are you, eh? I'm the one that's losing. Too hot, eh? Huh? Said I don't think you're doing too hot. Look at this, guys. This is a Tetris arcade. If you guys didn't know, this is an RPG, apparently. And we have all these. Look at these. Boom. Aaron.
Aaron apparently wants this, but thinks I won't let him get it. It's only 50 bucks. All I told him was he had to have a place for it before he bought it. But if he has no place for it, he can't have it. Dude, does anybody remember these things in like the Pizza Hut or the like bar and grills? I remember playing this when we used to go to Nickel City. Now he's just playing for fun. He lost a little tournament. But it happened. But look at this place, this is cool. A cute little trade event. Pop. Okay guys, we are we are on day two of our adventures in uh, Big Top Land. We're back. Here we are. Row F. F -f 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 -f. I, I like yesterday there's a sign right there. It says, uh, please keep uh, um, Big Top a smoke-free environment. And there was like three or four people standing by it that were smoking. It was just, it was just hilarious. I got a clip of it. It was funny. Yeah, there are some booths out here that have games, but a lot of them have games for what they're going for, for the most part. Not finding any actual deals as of yet, but uh, there's a lot of game vendors out here. This is our day two setup here at the Big Top Flea Market. Tons of PS4 and Xbox One games. Come check us out. Uh, Final Fantasy is still here. I sold a bunch of stuff. I sold the Wii in the box for 60. Um, oh yeah, I just realized that. I sold the Wii in the box for 60. <laughs> so, sorry to uh, the guy that uh, put a, tried to put a bid on it the other day on the stream. But 60 cash I got for that. I sold a ton of stuff. I sold a bunch of systems. We got walls of PS2, GameCube, Wii, Wii U. And then down here we got all of this stuff. All this retro, not much left in retro land, because I've been selling a bunch of stuff this weekend. I've made, I made it like a, I don't know if I said this already, but I made like a $200 sale uh, when I first walked in. I gave stuff away for a little cheaper than I wanted to, but uh, it was a good deal. But uh, yeah, back to what I was saying, and there was a customer there. Uh, so I made over $200, and it wasn't, it wasn't a cake deal. The guy, the guy does Amazon, and on Amazon, a lot of things sell for more money. So he was actually paying more than most resellers would pay on stuff, and and I only lost like forty to fifty dollars on the deal. He he bought he bought stuff at pretty pretty close to what I sell it for, you know, because I'm I'm already given deals on a lot of this stuff. So anyway, and a lot of it was PS2 and Xbox stuff. That's what surprised me, like Silent Hill 2 stuff like that. But anyways, uh, so yeah, I'm I want to say I've made between six and seven hundred dollars so far. Uh, I'm supposed to be doing a really, really big deal later today. If that goes down, I will I'll update you guys on that. But yeah, so far it's been a good trade event. Uh, lots of cool stuff out here. See you guys later. Woo! Laurel, I'm one box closer to having a complete box set. We got Knife Edge. Oh, that? Yeah, Knife Edge on the 64. I didn't show you this? No. We have the game, obviously, but he wouldn't... He wouldn't sell the box in he wouldn't sell the box in manual separate, but he did come down on the price to twenty five, and I can sell the game out of it for ten bucks. Do you think so. Justin would want that one? Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Speaking of speaking of Mr. Payne, we have a special guest coming, everybody. As if this doesn't already give it away. Jesus is coming. So yesterday, got it. Laurel got us a twelve dollar burger and fries and stuff. I was trying to spend less, but I ended up spending more because we didn't get one quesadilla, we got two and a soda. But oh well, it's food and it's oh, delicious. Why is that too? I'm never gonna finish it. Yeah, we got your controller. So, somebody showed up a little bit late, but uh, <laughs> we're still here. Yeah. What? Oh what? my God, turn what it off. What happened? Uh, so I just sold 
two original Xbox controllers. This guy right here. Or, the original Xbox yeah, controllers? Yeah. Original Xbox, oh. man. <laughs> original <laughs> original Nintendo to, controllers. What are you trying to tell yeah. some Nintendos yeah. online? Yeah, original Nintendos. Uh, Justin bought some. So it's cool to see him out here at the big top. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Laurel's got to ask a question. Okay, guys. So I just traded uh, two PS4 games for mini sports arena arcade thingy. Um, yeah, get hyped, Josh. It's coming home. It's time for everybody's favorite segment of the day, Laurel and Justin's question of the day. <laughs> What's what, the question? What is everybody's opinions on, on the on trade events in general? Yes, are they good? Are they bad? Garbage. Don't do it. Just buy online. Buy for me. Yeah. Oldschoolcrate.com. Woo! Sorry we didn't get it before. And yeah, yeah, we're, we're, we're leaving. Uh, it's the end of another oh, flea market weekend. Freaking stacked. Did yeah, you tell them what we traded? Yeah, I traded two PS4 games. Literally like eight bucks. I traded and I got an arcade machine. It's not a it's not like a, a regular arcade, it's a prize redemption machine. But uh, amazing deal. Uh, but yeah. So we'll see you guys next week, hopefully, for some more garage sale, flea market, whatever we're doing. Woo! Woo! What? What's up? Where are you at? What do you want to know? Where are you at? Where are you at? You're here. I see you. Hold the door. Oh, the door's open. Woohoo! Okay, so Josh, um, uh, today was a trade event, uh, as you very well may know. Um, yeah, um, I'm gonna need some help. I'm gonna need lots of help. For what? For what? Come on, let's go. Let's go get in the car. Let's go get in the car, Joshy. Buy that machine. Let's go get in the car, Joshy. Bought the machine. Let's go get in the car, Joshy. Why did you buy a machine? So, while I was at the trade event, somebody came up to my booth and they were like, uh, I want to buy these two PS4 games. And the two PS4 games totaled uh, $8 in value. And, and, and they're like, oh, okay, the well, uh, two PS4 games, $8. And they're oh, like, um, would you trade? Would you trade? Because we have something you might be interested in for these two four dollar PS4 it's games. Locked. And um, so they they took two PS4 games for the machine. <laughs> Look at his face! Look at his face! Surprise, mother trucker! Hell yeah. Woo! Where's my chair? Where's oh. my chair? Where's my chair? Big top. Go back and get it. <laughs> it's in the trunk. You gotta go to Vincent's. Well, what are you showing me, Josh? Yeah, look at this. What is that? It's a Tommy Gun vodka bottle. Look how dope I got two of them today at the flea market for 15 bones. No, I'm not Jake Bottles. I'm not Logan Paul. I'm smash. These are expensive. Look it up. Okay.